The which command is a rather simple command. All it does is it prints the path of an executable command somewhere on your system. For example, if I do a which Firefox, it gives me the location to the Firefox binary. And that is essentially all which does. If I do a which on Rofi, I have the Rofi launcher installed on my system, I get the location to user bin Rofi. That is the binary for the Rofi command. Now, almost all the time you use which, you're going to use which exactly the way I just did with no flags or options. It does have some flags and options, though one useful one that may come in handy on occasion is which A. So if you have an executable program name that has multiple locations, for example, on my home computer, I've got two different versions of GIMP installed. I've got GIMP through native packaging. I've got GIMP through snaps or uh, flat packs, you know, one or the other. And if I do a which A on GIMP on my home computer, it would give me two different binary locations. Now on this computer, I only have the native package installed in user bin GIMP. One neat little trick you can do with which, which does have this flag here, the dash I flag, and this has the ability to read aliases from standard input, and then it reports the matching uh, search patterns, the, the matching aliases that you give it to standard output. For example, my ls command is actually aliased to a different command. It's actually aliased to the eza command. So if I do which dash i on ls, this is not going to work. I'm going to hit enter, and it's going to say a hey, warning standard n is a tty. The proper way to do this is to type alias. So you have to run the alias command and pipe it into which dash i and then the alias that you're actually searching for and now i get the information about my alias of ls and i get the location to the binary of the program that i was aliasing ls2 you can see user bin eza a couple of other flags and options that may come in handy on occasion we have dash dash skip dash dot what this does is it searches your shell's path so when you do a which command it's searching the path the path is where all of your executable programs should be on the system and in this case we're telling the which command to skip any dot directories so those are the hidden directories the directories that begin with dot and if i you know then give it a program to search for it found user bin ls because user bin ls was in user bin it wasn't in like a dot directory for example if i ls here in my home directory I have this directory here for snap packages dot snap. If I had a, a, a program that I was looking for and the binary was located in dot snap, it would not return that because I told which to skip the dot directories. Another thing you can do is you can also skip dash tilde. This skips any directories in your shell's path that begin with the tilde character that would also, of course, skip your home directory as well. Now, if you want to learn more about the which command, type man which in the terminal to read the man page.